family members WCW Knights Well Grill. And it opened around 1999, around uh, mid-2000s. It was a pretty nice place you could sit there. It had a wrestling thing, the menu, you no know, food and drinks named after the wrestlers and and other stuff. And it had wrestling member Babilia on the wall. And you can watch Nitro. You can watch the pay-per-views there. You could buy wrestling Mobilia there. It was pretty neat. I mean, I've been there. I think I've been there once. I don't know. I don't remember if I anything. I think I just had a salad there. I'm not sure. But anyways, sadly, it did not last long because it was also around this time. This was around WCW's uh, final days. And it was uh, then brought by the WWE. And uh, it closed it. Well, I don't know if it closed its door before WCW. Or, yeah, I think, I think it was before. Yeah. And I think it was right after that that WCW closed its doors too. So, who um, remembers the Night School Grail? Now, if you're out east, another wrestling restaurant, WWF New York. Uh, another big place, and again, they had a just like Night Talk Grill, a little bit bigger. The wrestling theme menu had a big wrestling soft. We could buy all wrestling merchandise. It had an arcade. It had a club called The World. I think that's still there. And that, that was around for a little bit longer. And then I guess it kind of that closed its doors too. Yeah, so, tune in. We haven't had another wrestling themed restaurant. I think we should. You know, not, not WWE. I think a place where you just sit there and just watch any wrestling. And kind of like a sports bar type themed place again. Now, oh, nice to have again, you know? And we, we've become to be remembered. The Nitro Grill in Las Vegas, or WWE New York in New York City.